on number seven, before you go about trying to foil this all out and solve, there's no need to do that. For example, when you factor something, doesn't, doesn't your answer end up looking, you know, something like this? And then you get the answers, you just set both sides equal to zero and you'd get x equals seven and x equals negative three. Well, notice this is already factored. We don't have to do anything with it other than set this and this equal to zero and solve for x. So ultimately we're going to get 2x minus 1 equals 0 and we're going to get x plus 2 equals 0. Now the exponent here does not affect the x-intercepts, it just affects the behavior at the x-intercepts. And in this case we're going to just set both of these equal to 0 and x is going to equal 1 half and then x is going to equal negative 2 and that looks to me like answer choice A.